parts of the blue line shut down. Power problems forcing stuck riders onto tracks and onto buses. It is yet another issue for the Trouble T. WBZ's Tammy Mutasa is live for us in East Boston with more on what's happening there. Tammy. Well, David, tonight you can imagine just how disruptive and frustrating this is for T riders. We talked to passengers who actually had to walk down those tracks and get on one of these shuttle buses after they were evacuated from that train because of power issues. And right now, crews are working hard to make repairs. Over to Orient Heights, 24 hour power issue. Power line fell along the right of way. Trains will be offloading onto the right of way. More blues on the blue line. This time, this MBTA train was left stalled on the tracks after T riders tell us they saw electric sparks. Then the train stopped. MBTA officials say there was some kind of a problem with the overhead power lines. Soon after, commuters were told they had to get off the train and walk 500 feet of train tracks to the station. I just. It's part of the course, I guess. Darlene was lugging her groceries down the tracks, a first for her since riding the T for decades. Got it's it. scary. <laughs> it's scary walking. They're going down the stairs is more thing because you couldn't have anything to hold on to. Shuttle buses had to replace service between Suffolk Downs and Bowdoin, causing delays, confusion, and frustration as shuttles were dispatched. For me, it wasn't a normal day in the T. I take the T all the time, and there's something like this is new for me. You know, I see people complain all the time that things break down and things happen, but first time, this is the first time for me. While the power department worked on the tracks to make repairs for other riders, it was another day, another issue with the T. When is it going to stop? <laughs> really? I don't know. I just wish it was, I just wish they did something about it. And back out here live again, the power department is here working on repairs on those tracks and power lines. No word on how long that is going to take. Officials tell us the delays are running about 15 minutes as they're dispatching all these different shuttle buses. For now, live in East Boston, Tammy Mutasa, WBZ News. Tammy, thank you.